Right, so here are a few more products I'm going to be taking with me that I've made for the stalking show. First one is deer drag bags. Uh, made out of the 610 gram tarpaulin. Uh, it's an idea that I've had sort of like on a back burner for a while before I could um, basically get the tarpaulin cut to size with the rivets in the right places that I want them. So, like I say, it's a 610 gram tarpaulin. Uh, rivets uh, along the front, base, and then the middle at the top. Uh, I've put this one with a, a 6mm uh, bungee cord. Uh, I've also made a few with some normal sort of like rope basically, 6mm rope. So the cord is tied off at the bottom, laced up along the front of the bag, and then at the top I've made like a locking plate that you feed the cord through, a little bit, bit of a tug, and it just locks it in place. At the top of the bag is a heavy duty clip, the locking plate, and a piece of paracord. The paracord goes around the deer's neck so it prevents it from sliding out of the bottom of the bag when you're dragging it along. Also at the top of the bag there's two pieces of one and a half inch webbing that have been stitched onto the tarpaulin. These feed through two large oval rivets and then you can attach your drag rope to the bag itself. The sheet is five foot long and four foot wide. If you're watching on YouTube, I'll stick a link in the corner for the original video that I did regarding these drag bags. If you're not, I'll put a link down in the description or check out the Dana Outdoors YouTube channel. The other two items that I'm going to be taking with me are some deer harnesses. Uh, these are for carrying smaller deer such as roe, muntjac, Chinese water deer, over you'd be able to carry them over your shoulder. So two different versions, the cotton webbing style. Uh, this one has got smaller deer rings at either end, rope attachments, loops go around each one of the deer's leg. The other version that I've got is the full leather one. So the leather one basically is all hand stitched. Uh, this is made out of the shoulder strap is one and a half inch. Uh, on the webbing, it's a, a two inch strap. Uh, one and a half inch uh, D-ring at either end. And then on the leg straps, again, these have got brass D-rings attached to them. So open them up, put the deer's leg through, tighten it up. Once it's all there, you can just sling it over your shoulder. I'll add a couple of videos because I've got some people who have been trying them out already, so you can see what you think of them. Yeah, Alan, this is your strap in action on the Chinese water deer. With Jamie picking it up. There we go. And there you are. He's off Perfect. on his travels, look. Perfect. Thank you very much. See you a bit. That's it, Alan. Carried, supported, all nice and clean. Thank you, Jamie. Like I say, these will all be coming to the stalking show with me. Uh, if you want to come and have a look at them, I'll be there somewhere in the corner. I think I will, but I'll put all my details onto my social stuff so you know exactly where I'm going to be. Uh, you should be able to find as well. I'm there. But other than that, guys, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you at the show or get in touch with us.